What's up guys, my name is David Matos with 35millimeter.com and today I'm going to show you guys how to take a single image in Photoshop and use it with Instagram's new multiple image feature to create a panorama like this one. So first let's open our image into Photoshop, maximize our screen here and we're going to click on the crop tool right here or you can press C. You're going to want to go to the crop settings here and change the first number to how many pieces you want your image cut into. So for example, we're going to have ours into two images. So the first number will be a two and the second number here will always be one, no matter how many images you cut it into. Crop your image somewhere you like. I think this one looks good right about here. You can then click on the check mark up here or just click the enter button. Then you'll want to go to view new guide layout. Make sure columns and rows are both checked and you're going to want to enter the same ratio you entered for your crop. So this one would be two and then one. Then click on OK. Then go back to view and make sure snap is checked. Press C to bring up your crop tool and change the ratio to one and one. Now we're going to click and drag the crop marker and you'll feel it snap to the grid. Then click enter to crop the first image. And now we're going to save this image, so go up to Save As or Command Shift S. We'll call this one Image 1. JPEG settings, whatever you'd like. I usually use maximum settings here. And we've saved our first image. Now go back and press Option Command Z to undo our crop. Press C again, click on the image, and select our second square. And press Enter. Repeat our save as steps and we'll save this image as image two. Now we have both images saved to our computer. So now we need to upload them to Instagram. You'll need to transfer them to your phone. There are hundreds of videos on how to do this on YouTube for Android devices and iPhones. So I'm gonna use AirDrop. So I'll select both images, right click and share, then AirDrop. Click on my phone and they'll transfer wirelessly. Once they're transferred, start up Instagram, then click on the plus sign. Click on select multiple or the small square icon on the right side and make sure the image you want on the left is number one. And then click on the next image and it should show with a number two. Then click on next, select any filters you're going to add, add your captions, tags, locations, and then click on share. And that's it. Pretty simple once you get the hang of it. You'll have this cool two-part image that has no seams in the middle. So that's it for this week. Uh, real quick, short, and simple. Next week I'm going to try and do another gear review. I pre-ordered the Atomos Ninja Inferno as well as a cage from our G85. So if that interests you, make sure you stay tuned. I'm really excited for both those coming in. As always, if you like this video, make sure you click that button and please do subscribe. This is David. Until next time. <laughs>